Today we're going to talk about the maintenance of the CNC machine. We've invested a lot of money into it. We want to make sure that it lasts for a very long time. So we'll walk through a few things that we do on a weekly basis and a few things that we do maybe on a monthly basis. So stay tuned. There's a total of 15 grease zerks on this particular machine that we grease on average about once a week. I'm not going to show you every single one getting greased, but I'm sure you get the picture. One really important tip that I want to give you that wasn't discussed with me when I purchased my machine, but after you're done greasing, you don't have to worry about necessarily the grease zerks that are down low, but the ones that are up high, especially that's going to be over your material that you're cutting, clean that grease off of there. Now you're squeezing that grease in there. You know, you always probably squeeze a little bit more than you need in there. And so there's always kind of a little bit of a goopy mess um, underneath. Get a paper towel, wipe that up, because inevitably you're gonna be cutting, um, cutting your sheet goods or whatever you're cutting, and there's gonna be a glob of grease that's just gonna fall right on top of your material, and it's the worst thing ever. Um, so clean that up, just make sure it's nice. You don't wanna have that happen. All right, the other things that I will do, and I won't walk around the whole machine and do this, It's tight in here and you wouldn't necessarily have a, a great view of what we're trying to show you but outside of doing the greasing of the machine I always do a walk around every morning before I start the machine up to make sure everything looks the way it should right there's no uh, screws that are bolts that are loose in any way or there's nothing that looks out of position once you start the machine up and home it, it does move very slowly so you can kind of get an eyeball of what's happening with the machine if there's anything that looks out of sorts. But I like to spend some time just walking around the machine making sure everything looks the way it should. Um, I will spend time every couple of weeks going through and just finger, taking my fingers into seeing, making sure that the, none of the nuts and bolts are loose in any way, shape, or form. Um, there are a few that I will check more often than not, uh, especially on the gantry, but for the most part, I will walk around, you know, probably every couple of weeks and touch every single nut and bolt on this thing just to make sure things aren't rattling loose. So I that's about it for the maintaining or quick maintenance of the machine. Um, if you have any questions, go ahead and put those in the comments section. Um, until next time.